initially, in this vlog, it was supposed to be all the healthy habits I'm taking to 2023, becoming that girl, and then somehow it turned into a gym vlog, and then grocery shopping to fuel with the gain, started training Ellie, I turned into a matcha girly, then a whole ass storm hit California. We were flooded, and then I hit my brand new car that I've had for three days onto our garage. The most chaotic vlog ever. Well, I was supposed to be up at 6. It's okay. We're still gonna make this the best day, the most productive day. It's January 4th, to be exact. We do have a late start on the new year, but it's okay. We're still gonna make it our best year yet. <laughs> Good freaking morning! I just want to make this a starting the good habits for the new year, even though we are on January 5th, but it's okay. I got this cleanser for Christmas. I'm gonna use because I, oh my, it just fucking spilled everywhere. I'm gonna wash my whole face with it. I do wash my face every morning, but I don't do it at night, so that is something that I do want to do this year. Oh, this just wakes you up. This is the moisturizer I have been using. For my lips, I do Aquaphor. Yesterday, I went to go get my lip filler a little bit dissolved right here because for some reason, my lip anatomy is sh**. And I have a huge pocket right here. So whenever I do my lips, it always settles in this one little pocket. Let's get dressed. I feel like how you dress has a lot to do with everything. Let's pick out something that's like active, but also productive. Green pair of leggings, cropped hoodie, Gymshark, cropped little shirt. I'll be back. Just finished getting dressed. These are the green leggings, the Gymshark shirt. And you know what? I think I'm gonna wear this Lululemon crop shirt. This is the same one I wore in the last freaking video, but I just love it so much. It is an amazing sweater. It just makes you look so snatched and makes me feel confident. So I'm gonna wear it again. I do have acne all over my forehead here, the cheeks. So we're gonna cover it up with concealer. Obviously that girl has no acne, which is the girl we're trying to aspire to be. So I think eating healthy will help us get that beautiful skin. I'm hoping. Because what the f I'm not giving up pizza to not have beautiful skin. So just a little bit to cover everything up. We are going down the stairs now. Usually my windows all are automatic so they open. But this little one right here, I was too cheap to pay for the little remote because it's too small. So I was like, nah, I opened that bitch myself. I put on my Yeezys real quick. They just went with the black fit. Jacob was putting the dishes away and I'm going to help him real quick so we can get everything out of the way. Stanley cup. It's the only fucking way. I promise you every single girl has this cup. And if they don't, they want it. That girl drinks only water and matcha. She doesn't drink sugary coffee. So we're gonna fill this up with water Ugh. to take to the gym. But they take it to Pilates class. <laughs> but I'm not that much of that girl. I care, but not that much. drink this whole thing by today. It is my life's mission. It's one bottle of water. I don't think I've ever drank a bottle of water in my life, so it's definitely a mission. Cute! This sucks. Water makes me gag. Disgusting. Put my Apple AirPods on like that girl would. She doesn't use AirPods, she uses Apple headset. We're gonna go outside and train the girls, but I do like to just listen to like a podcast or music usually. And we're gonna go train. Let's freaking go. We got my drink. Let's start this baby. I put on my black belt bag to take to the gym just because it matches the fit. Let's head out. Our gym appointment is at 10 and it's 9.51 and we are gonna be a few minutes late. Ooh. Since my drink is cold, I'm gonna set up chill setting. The cup holders turn blue. Isn't that so freaking genius? I love it. We are ready to head the frick out. Dude, this car swears I'm gonna hit the wall. I'm not. All I see are we.
gosh. I'm actually dead. Jeez. We're gonna go to the grocery store. I don't have any groceries and I really wanna stock my fridge and you know, just fill it up with good stuff. I just haven't had any groceries. Be healthy, be good, you know, all that. New year, new me, all that bullshit that'll end in a month. I feel like I was always talking shit about their grass drink, but it's really not that bad This matcha, I don't know. It's kind of freaking good So the way that I get it is a grande matcha latte in a venti cup two pumps of sugar-free vanilla and oat milk All right I just got back home. I don't want to talk about it. I really really don't Oh my god my mind is just spinning. I already called right now an auto repair shop so they can fix it. I just don't want to hear anybody's shit. Like, I don't want to hear it. It was a f***ing accident. You're that girl, literally. You're <laughs> that girl. What the heck is macadamia milk, bro? Are you such a hater, dude? I'm just gonna make myself a sandwich so I can eat before I go deal with the auto repair place. This whole video just went to shit. Our two pieces of bread. Lunch is done. And then Jake prepared some mini cucumbers that I bought at the store. So basically all you do, you just put salt, tahini, and lemon. Almost tastes like you're eating chips, but it's actually just cucumber. Obviously sodium is out the fucking roof. Okay, but at least you're not having any grease. Me, 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 me. My dad installed this in the garage like two days ago and I'm gonna put all my stuff on here to organize the garage because it's so tight in here. But let me show you guys my car. Like I ate already and I processed it. Dude, honestly, there's just nothing I can do about it. So why am I gonna like cry about it, you know? Dude, this car swears I'm gonna hit the wall. I'm not. Here's the damage. It's like right there and then down there. Yeah, you're not. Yeah. Thankfully, it didn't hit the sensors. Let me show you guys where it hit. Okay, so I was pulling out and then it hit these rocks right here. These rocks caused the scratching. Damn. Who's girl, bro? I don't hit rims. I don't hit rims. <laughs> I was trying to go back forward and then fix myself because the issue is that this garage is so tiny that if you go off even by a little bit, you hit a wall. I was coming directly to this wall, so I tried to pull forward to move it this way so it wouldn't hit the wall. In the process, it hit over there. Do you see how little this space is? It's super, super, super tight. You have to do it perfectly. If not, you hit. Shit happens. You know, I didn't show you guys, but I actually peeled off my garage epoxy. It wasn't even me. It was just that the car came in with wet tires because it's literally been fucking flooded in fucking California. So I peeled off the epoxy. And my dad was really upset and I was like, dad, that shit can just be replaced. I'm not gonna ruin my day over it. Same goes for this car. When I hit it, I was like, <laughs> borderline crying. But I was like, wait, this shit can be fixed. Like, it's not worth ruining my day and just like going to bed and crying myself to sleep, you know? Like, it's fine. We're gonna get it fixed. It's okay. Obviously, it's a financial setback. But whatever happened, oh well. Boo-hoo, it already happened. Don't be a dumb bitch next time and it won't happen. I called this collision place and they said to bring it in right now so I can get like a quote on how much it's gonna be. What happened, happened. And now we just gotta deal with the consequences of it. Oh, now you be bitch. Lesson of the day. Don't be stupid. Stupid. Because then you have to go fix your fucking mistake. This area is gonna get repaired. When you disturb the sensor, it may need to calibration. All right, we're gonna leave the car here. I'm just gonna grab all my stuff. Oh, I'm so sad. And then I'm gonna have back on Mondays. Today's Wednesday. It's a four-day job. Look at how much darker it is in here, huh? Because of the black interior. I don't have gas. 
We're taking the baby mobile, guys. The Mercedes is being worked on right now. It's fine. It'll be back in a few days. For now, we're gonna use the baddie mobile. And then as soon as the Mercedes comes back, we're actually gonna take the baddie mobile to get fixed because I don't know if you guys remember, I basically got in a car crash. I was never able to fix it because if I took it to get fixed, it was gonna take weeks to get fixed. I needed a car. Anyways, I have two cars now. So I'm gonna send this one to go get fixed. And then both of my cars will be beautiful now. Anyways, we're gonna go to Lululemon and Target. I need new sports bras for when I go to the gym that fit my new boobs. And I need cleaning supplies and organizers. Let's head out. I haven't used the baddie mobile in like a whole week. I missed it. Oh my gosh. See, the baddie mobile is so different. Like, even the braking is different. I feel so much more comfortable in this car. I don't even know how to explain it. Like, the Mercedes is really, really cool and all, but it's a really hard car to drive. Look at what I found. It's a circle mirror for the entryway. <laughs> I just fucking got here. Why do I have $100 in my cart? I've been wanting a mirror for my entryway for the longest, and I finally found it. These are the perfect size for the racks in the garage. I'm taking four. This literally looks filthy. So I'm gonna need you guys not to judge me because new year, new me. This is literally how my restroom looks. Yeah, I'm gonna clean all of it and just be ready, like reset. Let's set everything right so we don't fuck up anything else. shrimp with veggies and I was like wait you can't just do shrimp with veggies because it needs to have like a sauce so I was like garlic sauce so I just added a buck ton of garlic but I was like oh my gosh we bought baby tomatoes at the grocery store earlier so I cut those up too and then it was a little dry so I was like mm, we need some type of cream so I put heavy cream and I was like mm, I need a little bit of cheese so I added like a little bit of parmesan and then we ended up with this concoction it smells really good we're gonna grab this is dinner I just feel like I've accomplished my life goal by just cooking two times a day already I feel great storm going on like I'm not even exaggerated like there's a real fucking storm coming for California right now it hasn't actually like hit yet but it's like the showers we aren't getting the worst of it North California is we're in SoCal thankfully the flooding is almost going inside of my garage it is actually scary this morning I woke up so freaking early it's 11 and I've spent the past three hours cleaning the house I officially decided that I was just gonna take down my freaking Christmas tree in my room fold the red blanket like I just wanted all the Christmas stuff out so it could be minimalistic again I'm literally traumatized with this garage. No! Bruh! <gasps> Bruh, my car is sliding. I've never experienced something like this. This is insane. See, everything happens for a reason. Maybe I hit my car yesterday because I was meant to take it to the shop because I wasn't supposed to drive it in the rain and I could have probably gotten a huge accident. I don't know. I'm just trying to make myself feel better at this point. Hey, can we do a grande matcha latte, please? Let's do it iced with oat milk. Can we do two pumps of the sugar-free vanilla? Yay! My car survived that. I was like, girl, I am not putting my window all the way down. And then I crashed my car, and now we're in a flood. Which one is it gonna be? I wonder what title I'm gonna end up picking. Can I get Yes, please. Thank you. The rain is getting fucking harder. 
That's what she said. Bruh. We got my Starbies. I don't know what the fuck is happening to me. How did I become a matcha girly? What? Oh, I'm not gonna hear the end of it from you guys. I know it. All right, let's go shopping. And by shopping, I don't actually mean like shopping. No, I do mean shopping. I'm not even gonna sit here and lie. Let's go to Lulu to get the line jackets that I was talking about. We need those. What the fuck? Uh-uh. What the? I'm gonna take my umbrella. I'm literally parked far as fuck from the Lululemon. How fun. Let's go. Oh my God. Open, bitch, open. Bruh, only crazy bitches. Like, I couldn't have just come to the mall a different day. I'm getting more bras. This is an underwire. I'm at Lulu and I'm trying stuff on. Let me try on the bra. Hold up. This is the sports bra. It fits nicely. This is beautiful. The material is so soft. <gasps> There's a 50% off sale at Hollister. I don't need it. I don't need it. I'm home and I'm making breakfast because I'm slaved in this house. As soon as I got in here, Jacob was like, make food. Anyways, it's technically 12 now, but I'm still cooking breakfast. We're gonna try to air fry the potatoes and I'll let you guys know if they come out good. These are gonna come out bomb. Air fried or not, they're gonna be bomb. Seasoned salt, lighting this up. I'm gonna spray avocado oil at the bottom. We're gonna put some on top. We got the potatoes. They were in there for like 20 minutes. They look a little crispy. So mid. The actual like potatoes are good, but they're just not greasy enough for me. <laughs> Anything to be healthy, I guess. 